Hello learners! Welcome back! We will continue our discussion in kinematics like what I have said in my previous lesson. Another way of describing motion is through graphs. That will be our topic for today. Most essential learning competency number one, interpret displacement and velocity respectively as areas under velocity versus time and acceleration versus time curves. Most essential learning competency number two, interpret velocity and acceleration respectively as slopes of position versus time and velocity versus time curves. Position time graph. This is an example of position time graph. We need to remember that position is plotted on the y-axis while time is plotted on the x-axis. Before we proceed, we need to know the advantages of using graphs in presenting data or information. Data can be presented in table form as shown in figure one, but graph is another way of presenting information. It can be used to show an underlying relationship between physical quantities such as position and time. Mathematics is the language of physics. So before we learn how to read graphs, we need to review your previous lesson in mathematics. Some terminologies and formulas will be used in physics. Let us recall the concept and formula in calculating slope. A straight line graph has a general form y is equal to mx plus v, b. In this graph, m is the slope. It is defined to be the rise divided by the run of the straight line. The letter B is used for the y-intercept. It is the point at which the line crosses the vertical axis. Slope is a measure of the steepness of the graph line, not in terms of angle, but rather in terms of the units along the horizontal and vertical axis. We are now going to apply that concept in physics, specifically in position time graph. Let us represent position by letter x. x sub 2 is the final position, while x sub 1 is the initial position. It is found in y-axis. Time is represented by letter t. It is in seconds. Take note that slope in a position time graph represents velocity. I will be presenting properties of slope in four different scenarios. Number one, slow, rightward, that is positive, and it has a constant velocity. This is the position time graph of slope with a property such as fast, rightward, that is positive, and constant velocity. Number three, this graph shows slow, leftward, that is negative, and it has a constant velocity. Lastly, this type of graph shows fast leftward that is negative and it has constant velocity. Please remember that whenever the speed changes, the slope of the graph also changes. This is the position time graph of a particle with constant velocity. Any moving particle having a constant 
velocity exhibit a straight line This graph shows a particle with changing velocity. A particle having a varying or changing velocity, which means accelerating, it exhibits a curved line. Okay, thank you so much.